You won't! Found something. Out in the hills, thought... Thought maybe you was in the market for it. For what? Some liquor. I ain't in the market for what's already mine. The way we see it, it's ours. <sighs> well, with us possessing it, and I, I checked all over. For the life of me, I couldn't see your name on it. Whoa. Relax, I ain't here to rob you. <laughs> oh, it seems that's easy enough. <laughs> Wanna do a deal? What do you sell that stuff for? Dollar a bottle. You give us 50 cents. It's already ours. Well, look on it as a reward for finding the property. Alternative is we go sell it someplace else. The alternative <laughs> is you get shot. Now, who wants to get shot over a bottle or two of liquor? <laughs> Pay the man. Pleasure doing business with you. And... Listen, uh, we didn't take it, at least not without orders from... Oh, I know exactly who gave you your orders. Old Sheriff Gray. You know what? I don't want it. In fact, sir, now you can do me a favor. There's an extra ten bucks if you do. Drive the stuff into Rhodes, head over to the tavern run by Mr. Gray, and give the stuff out for free. Mama! Hush now. I believe they call that a promotional expense. <laughs> As you wish, madam. You boys come back sometime and tell me how you made out. Maybe we'll play a little cribbage. All right. Next stop, the road saloon. Here we go. Okay, Fenton, stay calm now. For Mama, she loved you so. <laughs> Just a shame you had to strangle her in a rage, right? Grab two cases of that stuff and follow me. Gentlemen! Gentlemen! Quite the town you have here. We just rode in from up north. Hey. Hello! Hello, I'm Melvin. This is my brother Fenton. Don't mind him, don't madden him. He's turned idiot. <laughs> Killed our mother, but it weren't his fault. How'd you boys, how'd you boys like a couple of bucks? I bet you would. One for each of you. We're in the new trade of advertising, which is an American art form about ensuring people buy the correct things. I don't know. One more dollar. Says give us half an hour. What harm can we do in half an hour? <laughs> Go along now. Enjoy the money! Come along, Fenton. Let's hand out the liquor. Gentlemen! Gentlemen! My name is Melvin. That's my brother Fenton. He's a bit funny, but boy, can he pour drinks fast. For the next 30 minutes, the drinks in this year bar, in this year town, are entirely free. Yeah. The only rule is that you gotta drink them. So hurry up, put old Fenton to work. Don't get him mad, though. His mama made him mad, and we buried her. The whole thing. Ah. Now come up to the bar, everybody. Come on, boys. Oh, that's some strong Jeez, stuff, my boys. Don't be shy. <laughs> Advertising. Uh, come on in and have a drink. That's our goddamn liquor. An honest mistake. Boys, get him. Oh, 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 oh. 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 oh.
Sons of bitches dead! over a few bottles of booze? I reckon it's more they don't want another gang on their patch. All right. We're good. Yeah. Remind me never to take up a career in... What was it? Advertise. Yeah. You think that woman set us up? No, I don't think so. Maybe. This place is odd. Well, I keep seeing those fellas. Some local militia. That was fun, Fenton. We'll make an actor of you yet. <laughs> I'll go speak to Dutch. Ah, uh, a trap door, huh? <laughs> what you doing here? We found this place first. Yeah. Easy. I'm just looking around for some things. Hmm. That old revolver yours? <laughs> Finders keepers. Ah! Son of a bitch! Oh, God damn it. damn it! Come on, Dan! Where are you going? Come on! It's ours! Uh. How much? Look around. He can't have gone far. He's mine! 
Let me take him and get out of here. You have my friend. He's not your friend. I'll give you money. Be quiet. <laughs> Come on. You should have taken the money. I know. I'm a fool. Oh, shit. Thank you. Of course. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Gunshots are coming from that barn. Come on. since I was a boy. Damn fine piece right there. I've been practicing. Told you I was good. Ah. Help! Help! I need help! Oh, You're done for, bastard. Hello, Dutch. It's been a while. <clears throat> sure. So, uh, how's your gang doing? They still believing in you? Better world. Pure world. Hmm? How's that coming along? Just fine. Hmm. How's that score you stole off us? Which one? <laughs> oh, I like that. It's like I said, is it? Charismatic leader. A lot of heat on us this time. Both of us. A whole heap of trouble. They offered me a price, Dutch, to bring you in. Why didn't you take it? Well, I still might. I am sorry about your brother. Yeah, well, I never liked him much. I liked Annabelle. You always love the ladies, Dutch Vanderlyn. I like that about you. What are we doing here? Go home. Is this thing over? got a sense. Handing them over to the law, it's, I don't know. Strange times. They killed Seamus. Fuck the whole lot of them. With this fella Coleman yeah. right, we can draw them all back. <laughs> True. Where? He's escaping, shoot him! Relax, relax. I got him, I got him. Did I kill you? Oh, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> no, of course not. <laughs> not yet, but I will. <laughs> Finally, 
Put his weapons over there! No clue what you're talking about. Oh, you lie, my friend. And I thought Dutch preached true. Let me go, Cohen, and end all this crap between you two. We all got real problems now. The way I see it, they get him. They forget about me. They ain't the forgetting sort. If I were you, I'd run as soon as I had the money. <laughs> Oh, I know you would. Let's see. We lure an angry Dutch in to rescue you. Grab all of you and hand you in. Then disappear. So you only met with him to grab me? Of course. He's gonna be so mad. He gonna come raging over here. And a whole lot of you. And the law will be waiting for him. Arthur, <laughs> Arthur, I missed you.
Arthur. Arthur? Arthur. Well, I told you it was a setup, Dutch. Oh, my boy. My dear boy, what? They got me. Uh, I got away. Yeah. Yeah, you did. Miss Grimshaw, I need help. Reverend Swanson. He's gonna set the law on us. No, oh, of course he was. I'm sorry, Arthur. It is a bit late for apologies. Swanson! Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan, you're safe now. Oh, let's get him to bed. You are safe now, Arthur. Okay. I got you. You're safe now. That's pretty, Tuss. That's, that's real pretty. Miss Grimshaw, will you sit with him a while? Of course. You'll be okay, Mr. Morgan. You're home. I thought I'd be burying you, Mr. Morgan. Well, not quite yet, Reverend. <laughs> Good. How you feeling? Oh, uh, about the same as you. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> well, take care of yourself. You too. <laughs> 